You know, when you live your life the way that I do, when you live your life the way that Vinny Scarboni does, you don't really got a lot of friends. But you know, when you got a brother watching your back like Sonny Scarboni, who needs friends? But I got a short list. I got a couple people. Jigolo Mark Joker, you were one of my friends. We've been tight for years. You see, I like you. And your new tag team, the genetic jackpot, Joe Coleman. His boy, Idris Abraham. Those are my kind of guys. Yeah. My kind of guys. Guys that just don't hand out respect. See, I like your style, boys. I like the way you slap them and rose around like the pieces of trash that they are. I like that. I like everything you guys do. <laughs> At least until two weeks ago. When you guys signed on that dotted line to go into the ring at best in Detroit 15 against Vinny and Sonny Scarboni. Boys, boys, how arrogant can you be to think you're going to walk into Clinton Township Saturday night and beat God's gift to tag team wrestling? Gentlemen, you'll beat a lot of teams out there, but Vinny and Sonny, we ain't one of them. Joe Coleman. Joe, you call yourself Mr. Latter-day Night. Well, Saturday night, the only thing those big lats are going to be doing is laying flat on the mat when Big Vinny's got you down for one, two, three. And Idris, if you and Mark Joker went out got yourself some fly new clothes for your victory party, I hope you kept that long receipt because you're going to need it. Joker, you were right. You said it's not personal that this is just business. It's business. Being the best tag team around is my business. And boys, business is good. But Saturday, it's going to get even better. Halal beefcake. Yeah, right.